Well, Valentine's Day often means an expensive night out on the town, but it doesn't have to be that way. More than half of couples say they'd rather enjoy dinner and a movie right at home. So how can you plan this perfect stay at home Valentine's Day? Founder of PrettyExtraordinary.com, Danielle Smith is here to tell us a little bit more. Good morning, Danielle. How are you? I'm outstanding, Mike. How are you? Fantastic. Happy Valentine's Day. It's coming up pretty quickly. And I like this idea. Likewise, we move right from. Yeah, I'm sorry. No, I'm, I like this idea of staying at home, making it special. How do we do that? What, you have some ideas. I certainly do. Valentine's Day comes with increased pressure to create an expensive, elaborate experience, but it doesn't have to be that way. We're talking about staying at home, and how do we do that? Mike, I'm sure you've heard the phrase, the way to a man or a woman's heart is through their stomach. Mm -hmm. So we want our celebration to start with good food. My motto. First, I have a couple of suggestions for you. <laughs> yes, that's your motto, right? <laughs> so we're gonna start by making Valentine's Day twice as nice by combining two of Bertoli's classic sauces to create a creamy pink sauce that you can use in a couple of recipes. My suggestion, combine the Alfredo with aged Parmesan cheese, which comes with real fresh cream and Italian cheeses, and their traditional marinara with Italian herbs and fresh garlic. You combine those two and you get this beautiful creamy rosa sauce that you can use either here on the Caprese gnocchi with blistered tomatoes, or on spaghetti carbonara with creamy rosa sauce. Now, both of those you can find on Bertoli's website, bertoli.com slash recipes, or you can head to their Facebook page and you can find the recipe links right there. I have a second food suggestion. Okay, love it. I know you're jealous because I have all this food in front of me and your mouth has to be watering, but when you're considering snuggling up with your someone special, how about spoiling them with a bowl of delicious warm soup? Idaho and Steakhouse soups are flavor filled, they're affordable, and you can create restaurant quality flavor in your own home. So they have four flavors. You'll have to tell me which one is your favorite afterwards, Mike. So cheddar broccoli, cheddar potato, uh, loaded potato, and creamy potato. And you can, they're made with red potatoes, red Idaho potatoes, a lot of flavored spices and rich cheese. So you get that creamy taste in every bite and all you're doing is adding water. So these are available in grocery stores all nationwide and you can certainly head to idahoan.com to find more information on them. They all look good to me. Now, how do you create the right ambiance? at home. Um, what do you recommend? Now, what do you recommend doing? Important. You want it to feel like you're out, right? Right, you do want it to feel like you're out, but you also want to kind of keep it simple because that's part of not having that elaborate, expensive experience. So pulling out all of your red dishes or pink dishes and decorating with those, candles for ambiance, and then this is one of my favorites, putting flowers in ice cubes so that you can either spice up a cocktail or just your water, if that's what you're choosing for the evening. And my final suggestion has to do with the messaging. You know, there are so many cards out there, but what about the idea of rather than a prepackaged message, finding a card that's blank writing your own message or crafting an old-fashioned love letter. You mean be creative? That's a lot of work there. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but I have it, high expectations for you, it, Mike. I know, but it, it is more meaningful. It, what do you recommend though, when you have kids? It used to be easier when I lived at home and I was single and I had a date, and, but now we got kids and it's a lot more complicated now, Danielle. Mm -hmm. What about including them in the process? Yes. How special would it be to have your son or daughter help you to create that meal, like if you're making it for your loved one, and have them help with the decorations. Maybe they can cut out paper hearts or find a way to decorate your table. I love it. Danielle, where can we go for more information? Absolutely, you can head to Bertoli.com slash recipes for these recipes right here, Idahoan.com to find out where you can find Idaho and Steakhouse Soups near you. And of course, I will have all of it on my website, prettyextraordinary.com. Fantastic, Danielle, have a great Valentine's Day. Thank you. You too, sir. All righty. Kayla, over to you.